for 70 months. I, I appreciate that you broke your streak for buck snacks. Did that work? It doesn't appear to have worked. Why, though? I have a question to shoot. So, hello, ghost. And Abraxas. That's one. The code for the throne wish listing thing? I I don't know what that is. So hello, Palace and Epoch. Tell me more. Daedalus, thank you for 55 full months. Best small food is always to local. Mayor Schwarp. A lot of Asian fusion. There's also an Asian, or Asian fusion place that does tea and... That sounds delicious. grab from sites like Amazon. It's, and it requires a code to rather you need to be invited in order to use that sort of thing. Admittedly, or be on a wait list, that's Um, I need to think on that. I'm not even sure there is. I don't know if there's enough that I want or need that would warrant a wish list of that caliber. So need to consider. I can think of a couple to a few things, but they're more expensive than I would want to spend money for, so that's not really something that I would want anybody else to do. Clive years, how's it going? Yeah, I don't know why that's not working. I can increase the size. Sorry, I'm messing around with two things at once, trying to figure out why that. I can do that. I can do it here as well. Built Cinema. I've only had. Have I had that once? Technically, I think. I think I've had. 
It was like an Auntie Anne's. I am Ferdinand von Eyer. It's true, he is. A Cinnabon collab thing. I'm trying to do bean time. I would like to. They're still quite loud. Too loud? Didn't that work? Maybe it's still the cooldown. I have a feeling it's still the cooldown. Let's see. Commands. Yeah, I think that's what it was. Although, interestingly enough, Lily's doesn't have a cooldown and it didn't play. So maybe that is not it. Let's see. I'm going to restart Shimmer Pot. Hello again. sure I got this number right. I did. Yeah, that, no, it's not the cooldown. It is not a day. Really enjoying, but I mean, I am, yes, but it's mostly I'm trying to get through it. I would like to complete it. That's not to say that I'm not enjoying it, but that's not necessarily why I'm uh, playing through it so constantly. I'm trying to I'm trying out this thing where I don't drop games or like switch constantly. Plug jinx. Let's see. Uh I was I made it to what was essentially end game yesterday and I also made it to the uh the like extra aisle they added in an update recently. Let's see, can I? I what I am one of the users. Let's see. I'll cut a bloody path. How is that volume wise? Do 
give it a try. I don't know if it's per user or global. Would it need to change? Oh, wait. 30. Now, when I say global, I mean the cooldown, as in user-based, or once the command is used generally, it has a global cooldown, not a... That's not to say that it's accessible to everybody. Let me try it again. I'll cut a bloody path. Why was that one significantly louder? I changed nothing. I... Um... Hey, what? Hold on. It should be per user. It's no global. What the hell? Yeah, I don't understand. I changed nothing and that happened. Uh might be loud again. I don't know. I'm... Hmm. I apologize if it is loud once more. I'll cut a bloody path. Yeah, it, yeah, it is. But why, though? No straight roads. Or roads. I've not heard of it. What the hell? Hold on. Settings. General. Oh, what the hell? Why? That doesn't make any sense. A new device. Now let me... Let me do this instead. I'm going to mute it so you, sh you shouldn't be able to hear it. I'm going to try it again. Yeah, it's still just... Hold on, where is that coming from? What source? It's on the right source, the volume changes are just doing nothing. Wrath, thank you. And hello to all of you. What were you doing? Oh, I was Sea of Thieves. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand. Like, I can technically work with it, but not without... If I had one more auxiliary cable, I could make that work. I 
as it stands. Unless I reassign that to system and I don't want to do that now, that's not going to work. Well, something is wrong. Let's try this. Still for no reason, it's just loud. Even though I've changed the volume. What happens then if I were to do this? That seems fine. Also fine. It's true, he is. I don't, low as real, I don't understand why this is happening. He shouldn't have heard them. Just in case they are loud, I have them set to, uh, or I have things muted at the moment. That one's set correctly, I thought. Um, yeah, let's try this again. That's progress, Azrael. Did you? I need work that isn't crushing your body. That doesn't make any sense. Is there another that I can do? I apologize. I'm trying to this is this is more pressing than most of the other things if only because they'll be on constantly yeah that's just loud okay it's just not taking the Again. I hate technology. I 
go. I'm going to set it to 1%. That actually had an effect, but I'm going to, I'm going to play that again. So you all can hear. This is it on 1%. It's quiet. It's like, it makes sense that it's quiet because it's at 1%, but the fact that you could hear it at all is baffling. I'm sorry. It's, it's at 0%. Uh, let's change. It was at 30% before. I'm going to change it to 10. that to five. That's fine. Okay, let's sort out the rest of these. Five. Why is this on 80? Oh God, I don't want to know what that would have been like. I'll deal with that if it comes to it. I... I... There's Ferdy. There's Ferdy. I'm just going to assume that I have to all these down here. Hydrate. The most infuriating part about this is I normalized all these volumes to what they were before me fucking around with it right now, like changing it not too long ago. And it worked. But something is making it revert, and I don't know what. That's fine. Let's Okay. Alice, can you cut a bloody path? The groundhog, I'm sorry.
suspend the Oh. I just that. Either Lily or Palace, can you use your things? I have a theory. I'm hoping I'm not correct. Because if I am, that's going to annoy the everything out of me. Okay. That seemed fine. The other order of business is figuring out why it's not. Music change coincided with your command. That's an interesting piece of uh, it is in the game for sure. Snacks will make me big Chandlo. I saw this huge snack lifting stuff near the river. Big lifting? You know I gotta get me some of that. Oh, that's terrible. That's not what. Boy. 
debunker. Well, Parkour. This is the extra island. Feeling that's going to be a prop. This is extensive. Look at its stupid face. No, we're going out together. Interesting.
chili cheese dogs at the mall. Guess who's back? And we we talk. Come back. There's no escape for you this time. Fuck. Clip that, that's illegal. That's not going to work. It's all in the timing. Chocolate, chocolate. 
Okay, where'd it go? And what the devil? Okay, that's not. That's. Legal. Give it. Give it. some work to do. What an awful sound. What's making it? Perhaps that thing. So, fire, that thing for sure. trick. First try. Where'd he go? Hmm. 
Vabs. Oh, it's awful. Oh, yeah. I can feel the lifting energy inside me. But Sometimes I think this game sounds like at which, all. Had, which chat, oh no. I guess I didn't get huge eating that big bunger either. You know what, bro? I'm just gonna admit to myself that it's not gonna work and move on. Guess that means my investigation's over already. What do I do now? Relax, huh? I guess it's been a while since I just chilled. I've been so busy fixing up Snacksburg, training, life coaching, and, you know, I've always got to take care of Snorpy. What the grump? Let's hang! We ought to shoot some hoops! All right! Hoops, 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 hoops! It's you know the rules, crap. Dog. We're gonna take turns shooting hoops. First one to make five baskets wins. How did you Go set this up so quickly? Your first shot. You got one point. My turn. <laughs> Grump, I missed. That's two points for you, bro. My turn. <laughs> Grump, I missed. Three points, dog. My turn. <laughs> nice one point. You got four points. My turn. <laughs> Two Shit. points for me. Whoa, five points. You won, dog. I didn't know you were such a baller. We gotta have a rematch sometime. Thanks for playing with me, bro. Now that we're done hanging, I gotta get back to Snacksburg. I gotta go check on Snorpy. Let's get one, two, three. Yeah, I know. Shell to pull the muscle trying to pick up a leaf. But they'd still have you. Oh, bro. I'm gonna be real with you. This is the longest I've been away from Snorpy in years. And he's not okay without me. How about this? I'm gonna need some big energy for the trip back. You get me two of the biggest, strongest bug snacks on this island. And I'll stick around till I'm fueled up. Yeah, that's probably not the um, most healthy of relationships. I have work to do, though. That's... Uh, so I got you. That won't work. What can I set on fire? Get out of here. I'm busy. Don't. Don't. I appreciate that you like me.
Oh, that's a problem. That's kind of a big problem. What? Oh, no. So, hey, you little. Give me that. No, not Can we? Can we not? Stop it. No, go home. No, get out of here. You mother... Should have waited. Bonk. Oh my god, parkour. Millie 
Charlie Mochi. Oh, rude. Uh, where were we? I have a gift. Do you, do you wish to? No? Okay. There you go. Gotcha this time. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I'm sure it's important. And big campfire. That was one over there. an evil puzzle. Juke me or did it go upstairs? You cheeky. Oh. The spider descends from the heavens, eats it whole. Or better. Concerns. Oh. 
Egg, egg, oh egg, no. Eggler. Eggler. Concerns about. Oh, you know. Just. Snack things. I was supposed to do that. No, that's just fine. gonna gonna you you gonna no okay um well Probably fast travel. But as we all know, I'm a hero. Feeling that's not gonna well could be what I need. that in a second.
why'd I do this? Oh, jeez. has to be for something. But what? That's the right thing to do here or not. But I do know that I have two of them. Ah, oh, hell. Ah, oh, hell. Ah, oh, hell. naked just has a good shirt off it's fine
Judo chop. I made a friend. Would you rather fight an orangutan once a year, each armed with a sword? And the orangutan gets 70 training montage. Would you rather fight a chicken in peak physical form each time you enter my uh, chicken? for the chicken if it's in the car if the windows rolled up oh my god interesting terrible. That's true. Bunga, 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 bunga. Hello, Miss Pyra. You. Yeah, yeah. Wait, can I also... Hold on. I wonder if I can do that. The set it carries the elements. Does that also include Wawa? It seems to. a matter of national security also what's your flight path balls all right
That's wrong. exactly get it. One summer and an exterminator later. Millie, 
Millie, Millie Mochi, Millie, Millie Mochi, Millie, Millie, Millie Mochi, Millie, Millie Mochi, Millie, 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 Millie,
too much so good though no regrets oh. Oh, hey while you were out there I've been thinking before I go I need some major guidance normally there's stuff I can't talk about cuz Snorpy's always listening in so if not now when all right Sheldon's waiting Hey, Shell Dog, can I get You're some amazing. of your wisdom? I can really know. Thank you for doing the thing. Good to have you. I'm worried about Snorpy. That's three, but it's not showing it. Once more shall you be reminded. Snorpy is safer than we, Chanlo. Ease your burden. That's... that's not what I mean. I'm worried about the way he's been. All the paranoid stuff. The anxiety. I thought bringing Snorpy out here, out into nature, it might mellow him out. Flush all the bad vibes out of his system. But it's only gotten worse. I've known Snorpy all my life, but it feels like he's getting further away from me and, and I just don't know what to do. Uh, one must in the path of the mother. No, uh, hold on. One does not want one's words to be misinterpreted when one says, that boy needs therapy. Well, yeah. Yeah, for sure. And I'm trying to do that. I make sure he's safe. I listen to his problems. I try to help him feel valid. All that stuff. Chandlo, you are strong and wise and wonderful. And you can do everything to support him. But you cannot fix him. Understand? Snorpy is lost in a maze of his own making. And it will take a professional to help him escape. That's a lot to take in. I need to think about it. Thanks for your wisdom, Shelda. You know, thank me when you actually take my advice. Hey, bro. While I'm still out here, I want to talk to Triffany and Floofty, too. There's still more I gotta know, you know? I'm happy to chat with Chan Lo. Let's meet by the campfire. What's going on, Chan Lo? Trippany, you know about history and like ancient societies and stuff. Shelda said Snorpy's lost in a maze of delusion. But what if it's not a delusion? What if there really is a Grumpinati? Well, I've done some research on my own. And, uh, near as I can tell, there's no such thing. At least not in the way you see in the movies. There's no shadowy cabal secretly in control of the world. <laughs> Real conspiracies can't happen. And heck, there was an old literary society called the Grumpinati. But aside from the name, it's not at all what Snorpy talks about. Are you sure? I mean, I've seen Snorpy's charts and... They kind of make sense. Kinda is the important word here, though. Look, there are points of data on that chart that are real, but it's all those strings between them that are made up. No, those are real. We got them from Gramble. Oh, Chandlo, that's not, uh, what I... Up, 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 let it go, my child. Point is... Snorpy might be a talented engineer, but he's no historian, and he's certainly not immune to bias, you know? Yeah, I guess you're right. I hope you're right. Thanks for talking to me, Triff Dog. No problem! And if you ever want to know more about failed conspiracies throughout history, you know where to find me. Bro.
Oh, I suppose it was only a matter of time. Tell Chenlo I will be with him shortly. Are we here to speak ill of my brother? I will gladly go first. Complaint one of 294. No, no, that's not why I asked you here. But I do want to talk about Snorpy. He wasn't like this when we were kids, right? I mean, he wasn't always so on edge, was he? Snorpington has always had his imagination and his moral compass. But no, I suppose he's gotten markedly more distraught since our project's dissolution. What happened between you two? I mean, I heard some of it from him, but I always wanted to hear your side too. And Snorpy doesn't really like me talking to you. Oh, I'm aware. I have a pile of threatening letters to that effect. However, I will gladly take this opportunity to set the record straight. We were working together on a government-funded research project. Advanced prosthetics that are ten times stronger than an ordinary grumpus. But our dear Snorpington discovered that the government had less than savory plans for that technology. And despite my protestations, he tried to make those plans public knowledge. Well, yeah, I don't blame him. Even you got to admit, that's pretty jacked up, dog. Am I the world's only optimist? That technology would have saved lives. If it must either exist with some consequences or not exist at all, I think the choice is clear. Easy to say when you aren't the one living with the consequences. Yeah, <laughs> where did you come from? Shoo! <sighs> Unfortunately, Snorpington agreed with you. He tried to play whistleblower, but before he could make a sound, we were both fired. And after that, there was a campaign to slander both of us, to discredit any allegations he might still make. So, there really was a conspiracy against you two? <laughs> if you must call it that. But only the most boring sort with paperwork and lawsuits. Still, that means it's not all in his head. Don't mistake justification for reason. Snorpicton has moved well beyond the realities of our situation. All right, Flifty. Thanks for telling me all that. Mm, happy to have enlightened you. Honestly, I expected this conversation to involve more shouting and headlocks. No, not this time. We're cool. But hey, we should talk more often. And maybe I can show you how to headlock me. Perhaps. But for now, my work beckons. Oh, thank goodness you're here. I'd say it's high time we get to exploring. I see another maze blocking the way deeper into the jungle. I bet if we solve it, we'll find something real exciting. I'll go ahead and make my way over to the maze. Meet me there when you're ready for some puzzling. <laughs> I feel like there's a huge weight on top of me, and it's not the kind I can lift. Snorpy never would have come to Snack Tooth if I didn't push him into it. All I do now is make him exercise and ignore all the stuff I don't understand. Sheldon's right. I don't know enough to really help him. And thinking I do is only making it worse. I'm gonna stay here. Until everybody's ready, anyway. I need some time to just think. Where's this maze that she speaks of? I to sneeze. I'm also eating Oreos, which is why I'm so quiet. But I'm also sneezing now, shit. That 
Millie Mochi is an opportunist. It knew I was sneezing. God damn it. Was good. This is where I parked my camp. Anyway. Guess I'll have to run around until I find it. Indeed. No. No Millie Mochi. that up there, which I didn't see. That's because I need to lure. Ah, okay. What do you like? If you like ranch, I'm going to be upset. Jeez, that makes sense. Oh no. Oh my god. It's so upset. And yet it's having so much fun. Hey, get jerk. What I do while we wiggling. Yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, Jesus. Never asked for this. That's a stairwell. There was another breakable wall somewhere. Nice to be away from the others for a minute. The arguing can be, uh, distracting, you know? Oh, well, I think Shelda's got a lot to teach us. It's just exhausting to get a real answer out of her. Then she can be, uh, tad judgmental. Gosh, I don't know. I feel like I ought to be taking more of a leadership role out here. But I do all my best work when I'm alone. <clears throat> Anywho, no use dwelling on that. Looks like you went and solved that maze before I could even get here. Oh, let's go inside, scan around, and see just what kind of ruin this is. <laughs> Judging by what we've seen, I'd say this was a communal living space. One of the few that wasn't utterly destroyed anyway. And gosh, technology and culture are so much more advanced than what we've seen so far. This city must have been the center of Stone Grumpus society. And at the very center, the temple, possibly led by a priestess of Mother Nature A. That's a great question. There's definitely easier ways to lock a door. <laughs> but seeing as this was the height of their craftsmanship, it's possible they built those mazes just to show off. I don't know too much, but I'll say it's one of the world's oldest practicing religions. I'm sure Shelda could tell you more about it, but on that subject, it's odd I never saw hide nor hair of Mother Nature A back on Snack Tooth. It's possible she showed up relatively late in their culture, adding to the existing worship of bug snacks. Oh, I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> never look a gift temple in the gateway, as Grandma used to say. <laughs> I'll meet you by the entrance, yeah? <laughs> Bunga 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 Delicious. Go and rock it by Ruby. Oh, hey! You can see the camp from up here. At a nice, safe distance. Anywho, there should be a mechanism here that'll get us through that door. Might be a bit of a jog, though. 
How many are better than a giant bunker? I don't know if any are better than a giant bunker. There are some pretty good ones. This one I fucking hate. So it's it's not even rude. Like that's the thing. That's the most annoying part about it. It's look at it. It's fine, but it's so annoying. I that wasn't there before. Neither was that. Oh, I see. Oh fuck, where are you? Why didn't you just dive into Oh it put it out. What a jerk. Architects were definitely showing off. But you know, this ludicrously complex maze tells me that whatever's in the temple beyond is just that important. So you know the drill. Let's get to solving. <laughs> okay. Probably could have. Can I? Nope. Eh. Maybe if I'm fast enough. But what the devil? Why though? Rolling around at the speed of sound. Oh, I made a 
Huge mistake. Worked out. No shit. Nope, nope. I hate it. I hate it so much. Power not to just jump in and do it myself. Anywho, the way is open, so let's get going. Trifney is a backseat gamer. Hmm. Well, that's a kick in the teeth. So much for seeing the temple. Judging by the bodies, this collapse must have happened when folks were still living here. Maybe the crater is connected somehow. Come to think of it. We didn't find a single corpse back in the commune. Where'd all those grumpuses get to? Well then, I'm not about to let this mystery go unsolved. I've just got to roll up my sleeves and clear this rubble myself. Oh, no, no, we don't need to trouble everybody with all this. I know my way around ruins. I'll be just fine on my own. You just leave this to me. Go on about your day, and I'll have it done in a jiff, okay? Miss Pyra has been selected. I mean, I get it. Okay. I made a huge mistake. Do you go past the owl? There's another wall somewhere that breaks. Parkour. ramp here. How was it an impromptu like a wasn't an intentional nap is what I'm trying to say. Or was it one of those naps that just sort of happened? Yeah, I don't know where it is. Maybe I've broken through, I don't know. I just fall asleep is when I definitely do not want to and that's when I'm sitting at my desk oh uh, why I you know it's fine I, I go faster this way I don't know how to get the beat I need to ask around you know 
talk to the people in the streamer about Discord and see if I can get some help with it. Because the sub counter is only counting um, like unique first time subs. It should be a three currently. Because Lily, Daedalus, and that girl you know all subbed. But two of those were resubs. And one was prime. Oh, it's not going too good. I'm starting to worry I might never see the inside of this temple. I don't know, maybe he could. But if I put him in any danger, Snorpy's gonna hear about it. And then I'll hear about it every day for the rest of my life. Knowing them, they go and whip up some chemical that dissolves rocks and only takes three-fourths of their blood to make. It's safer for them if I don't ask. Ah, could be. But I don't know that I need even more riddles to solve. Besides, I've heard the sounds her back makes. She could really use a lie down. Oh, I was afraid you'd say that. Sure, teamwork would really help out here. But those grumps can't go more than an hour without starting a big fight. And I, uh, I just freeze up. You know, I'm an expert in my field and all. But I'm not a management type. It's better if I just concentrate on my work and let them cool off on their own. Why do you carry a bone hand slash arm? To be honest, no, I don't. These kind of spats, they just fester and grow. And before you know it, civilization collapses. Look, some folks just don't get along. Some mysteries just go unsolved. There's nothing I can really do about it. But at least we gave it a shot. I'll see you back at the camp. Probably just her back scratcher. harder to find the evidence if you take it with you fair enough she just oh no mm. i cannot believe what i just saw that thing just bullied that ant Can you imagine uh, getting lost? Like you're driving through Kentucky or something. No, no, better yet, Delaware, that place that doesn't exist. And you're, you're driving through, you get lost. Indeed. You have to, uh, you have to pull over, you're hungry. So you, you turn off the road that you're on into this, uh, this nothing town and you walk into a diner that says uh, what you think is burgers, but it's, the R is in a weird font. It's like, it, it's, it kind of looks like the word bunger, which is strange. You walk in and there's just this thing behind the counter. Never leave. Where can you find this magical place? Delaware, which is a magical place in and of itself. This shrinking spice intrigues me. What substance could produce such a pronounced effect on bug snacks? 
from what I observed, it was manufactured by ancient Krumpuses, so surely it'll be simple to recreate. So it... I have uh, discovered that all mods should be able to deal with the quote button. That should have been the case from the beginning. So I don't know why it wasn't working. Oh, please. Bring an ancient Krumpus to the present and they'd be utterly lost. Anything they can do, I can do fundamentally better. Frivolities aside, I require a sample of shrink spice for study. Bring a specimen here and place it into my trough. <laughs> There it is. How? That's interesting. Have I not? Huh. This is beans. What the heck? Well, that did it. Rain. What the heck? Thank you for hitting Carlson. 55 Jinx, Zed Head, and Rune Prism all in the, the face. Heck? That should have reset it back to zero. What the heck? But it says two. I'm very confused. Like, that was it. That was exactly the amount needed, so I know it's working properly. I just don't know why it's... Right, it says two, yeah? Hmm. Well, at least I know it's working. So I guess what I'll do is this. I'll turn that off and I'll keep track of it uh, mentally and see if it counts it as it should. And we'll know because we'll get the this is beans message and we'll go from there. No, it, it's counting the gifted. It's counted all of the subs correctly for the counter. It's just the text file that it's supposed to be updating as an updating properly. All right, I don't have my, um, my camera set up mostly because I need to clean a little. So we're going to do this just, uh, with audio. Here's a spin. Oh no. Buttered popcorn or rotten egg. Oh God, I, okay, so for those of you who are unfamiliar with what we're doing here, for every seven subs for pretty much the last week of each month, I'm going to extend it till next Friday, just cause I started, I was supposed to start Tuesday and did not, cause I didn't have everything set up. But um, for the last week of each month, I will be doing bean boozled. I'll eat a bean boozled bean for every seven subs. And bean boozled, they can be either good or bad flavors, and they all look the well. Each distinct, uh, like visually distinct bean, has two possible flavors it could be. So a blue bean, for instance, could be toothpaste or like a blueberry thing. Berry blue is what it's called. So for this one that I'm about to eat, it could either be rotten egg or buttered popcorn. Neither of which are very good. I don't care for the uh, the butter popcorn, but it's better than rotten egg. You see whole handfuls? Oh no! All right, well, 
Do I have water? I do. All right. To this day, I have not spit one out. I'm going to try to keep that up. Here we go. It's buttered popcorn, I think. I'm pretty sure. I hate it regardless. Tell me how to pronounce that. I'm going to go with Steo until you tell me otherwise. Thank you for doing the thing. Stiorn, okay, thank you. Thank you and good to have you. Is that a... Well, I guess... You won't know. Me. No, give me the. Yeah, that's real weird. I don't know why it's doing that. But that's not accurate. That's the first. It's supposed to reset every seven. But it hasn't been counting things. Well, that could have been worse, I suppose. I'm pretty, I would know if that was rotten egg. I can only imagine. But. But. Understand. Hmm. It's not expressly necessary, it's just confusing. I was, I came 
came here for the spice. Oh, wait, maybe that's... substance becomes quite volatile when removed from its origin. A flaw in its design, perhaps. How troublesome. I may need to employ a more direct method of study. By which I mean, bring another sample here and throw it at me before it combusts. Wow, that's rude. I am wearing goggles, aren't I? <laughs> Since the spice causes no apparent harm to bug snacks, I am reasonably certain that I will be fine. But you're like 98% bug snack. What if you shrink? But Unpleasant. <laughs> However, having experienced that, I have learned two very important facts. One, the substance does not work on grumpuses. Two, I should not do that again. I am no closer to obtaining a usable sample of shrink spice. However, spice girl. I believe we may learn something from the local bug snacks. Use the shrink spice to capture one cheddar and one milimochi. Then transform me with those specimens. If you insist. And into a jet orb. Jet orb. Ow. Intriguing. Millimo. Yum, yum, yum. Millimo. Millimo. Oh, neat. Ah, decently competent work. Unfortunately, any remnants of the spice seem to have been digested, but this too yields interesting results. In their shrunken state, the bug snacks here are not fundamentally different from those on Snack Tooth proper. I am still forming my hypotheses, but I presume the process is endemic to this island, and the spice was created to inhibit it. None beyond the usual. <laughs> After all, Chandler ate a Bunga Royale as soon as we arrived. And he seems alive and well. It will be simple. I am merely exhausting every avenue of study. It's called being thorough. Look it up. Now, I've observed chocolates capable of maintaining a small size. This may present a more stable vessel for the spice. Regrettably, I must not eat it, delicious though it may be. So, bring one to my science trough, please. <laughs> At last, a viable sample! Now I can extract the powder and finally put this mystery to rest. This requires my utmost concentration, and you ask far too many questions. Those are you teeth. may return when I found my answer. <laughs> Blast it all! I do not need your distractions. I've obtained dried particles of plant slurry. But I, have I no hated way that to sentence. Analyze them. It's like living in the Stone Age out here. 
Perhaps if I had a particle separator, an electron microscope, and a degree in botany... Mm, bah! Plants are not my area of expertise. Can we turn flute into a mochi? Then I'd have to change uh, Chadlo. You cannot be serious. I would sooner eat my bow tie than listen to a word of Shelda's advice. Afraid? I simply do not want to waste my valuable time being lectured on archaic moral dichotomies. If Shelda knows the secret of the shrink spice, I will eat my bow tie. Very well. Since you clearly won't stop pestering me about this, let us go see Shelda. One senses the reek of a foul presence. See there he is. hostilities, Shelda. I am here on business. I've been informed that you may possess a rudimentary understanding of phytochemical reactions, which I am in need of. Strike the stars from the sky! The Wicked One has come to me for guidance. Okay, but surely one's ancient ways are far too primitive compared to the miracles of modern science. I do not appreciate your sarcasm. If you do not wish to help me, then simply say so and be gone with you. One would never. It is one's path to offer guidance to all who seek it, no matter how undeserving they may be. Very well. Then I require an analysis of the shrink spice. Tell me what is in it, and be quick about it. Please. Hmm, ah, yes. A poultice made in the herbological traditions of the mother. <laughs> Though its purpose I cannot condone. If that is what you desire, then one will enter the olfactory realm to find the answers you seek. What? Don't sniff. I know that. Ah, so many subtle aromas. Witch hazel? Cinnamon? Ah, black tea? Each a natural remedy for inflammation. And among these astringents... <coughs> Oil of vitriol. Oil of vitriol? That's sulfuric acid. A common but powerful desiccant. That certainly explains the burning sensation. Floofty, did you tell the journalist to throw acid at you? Well, this has been surprisingly not a waste of time. I am going to leave now. I may call on your services again. And you're welcome. Horrifying. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's fucking metal. You know what? I like that one. 
Who dares beckon Dave? stick but I did feed him a stick bug oh there's something something cruel about giving him stick arms what what is see that are forfeit. what lies within those supposed shrines to Mother Nature. Not shrines destroyed and forgotten, but one untouched by the ravages of time. One can see it up along the river's path. That is the place we must meet. Mercifully, the path is free of obstacles. One thanks you for your devotion. The path once more revealed, and yet no less treacherous. One's heart is filled with dread for the truths yet unknown within the River Shrine. Nevertheless, we must push forward. <laughs> Here he comes. How are you gonna? Oh, thanks for meeting me out here. I guess if it's just you and me, <laughs> I can keep it casual. Oh, the front entrance to this place looks too strenuous for these old bones. But I believe there's a side entrance into the shrine. When you find it, can you please open it for me? Damn it. Jet Orb, I need your assistance. In the words of that one alien from... Oh, God. What? Uh... Galaxy Quest, we need your help. 
Wait, this is a bomb. I don't have a lot of time. I'd like to launch it there, I just don't see... Maybe? I've caught the... Uh... Spaghetti... Whoop. Spaghetti. I've not caught the, uh... The other one. I think that's the only one I haven't caught yet. Ex Why do you look so... No, you're fine. Alright. Oh, she was mad at me. I would strongly encourage you not to take Tylenol with alcohol. Just, no, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, you should probably wait. No, bunker. No, 
know what? Bunga, 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 bunga. Get him, Parisa. I need to get you out of there. You're gonna break that one too. Well, it's fine. Come back. Uh. Uh. Oh. Honestly, that I should have just did that and launched it. I'll do that now. Interesting flight path. Ow, what? Wow. Gonna be late. Gonna be late. I don't think you can land that shot. I'm going to wait. Now. Fuck. around. I'm glad I retracted that. And so we wait. I should have timed how long it takes to get there. Oh, that sucks.
this should be good enough. Now for this nonsense. It means no bug snacks. How do I How do I get you up here? Illegal stop. What happens when you run out of places to hide? it up there and pray it rolls through. Pick a god and pray. I want to know why it does that. I love it, but I want to know why. Wait, shit. This is fine. That's not fine. That sucks. 
That sucks a lot. I haven't showered in years. Derek Chabot, that's why. Are you? I want answers. Hey, what's up? here. That could do it. I can almost guarantee that there is an easier way to do this, that there's a simpler way to break that wall. However, I am determined. Chris? It, how did, who did that? water though that's kind of an issue well maybe not so much bunker don't you do it bunker i need you to just chill out for a second 
No, this is fine. It's not fine. She's like, what are you? Okay, it does not care. If there's enough time. It's going to work. That opens it. So that means... You don't even go all the way around. You just circle there. Never scan that. That's interesting. Why, though?
So I was able to open it just fine. But I can't get in there just fine. So it has to involve... I think that was to get up here for that. Dyra Miss Pyra. It's kind of like an egg. That's how you definitely book it. That doesn't make a difference. Freezes the state. Get him. I guess I should freeze him first. Take care of Braxis. That does work. But you don't like. around at the speed of sound. Get 
Unfortunate. Let's go and add it. That's probably pretty simple. I'm just stubborn. I want to see if I can get this to work. Launch him when he's big. I can just circumvent a decent chunk of this. Here he comes. Yeah, I didn't think so. How can we refine the plan? Ooh. 
Oh wait, that's acid. Yeah, I'm sure it's fine. What if, and it's a big if, but it could work if I'm fast enough. That's interesting. Set the timer. Why, though? Sure, this is fine. Just let me pick it up. You know what? I'm sure that's gonna go over just fine. Not enough time. Oh, 
Come on. Now we wait. decision to make. What do you like? Not chocolate. I believe there's a side entrance into the shrine. When you find it, can you please open it for me? Oh, <laughs> 
There has to be something I can see on. wanted that to work like I knew it wasn't the way to do it but I had hope that it would work nonetheless Game is like reverse ASMR. Billy Mochi is my enemy. for that any good you know despite it being listed as dlc what on earth Those are all lit. Tuesday is the plan for, oh God. Oh no, that's so soon. But uh, yeah, one of the, the milestones for Caged um, fundraiser thing was reached. So I'll be reading through all 90. I don't know if I'm gonna do it all in one stream, but I'm gonna read through Garfield effects starting Tuesday. 
helps people at a milestone in that fundraiser. I feel like I'm going insane. Yeah, it's Tuesday. I'm not, like, this isn't me asking the answer, just to preface this. For those of you that know the answer, I'm not being insane, right? It's not terribly obvious. is fine. I liked my way better. I can't do that. Okay, good to know. That'll save me a bit of time. It's so complex. I wanted it to work. It was a good idea. And it was a fun idea. I will say this game is, um, as far as the puzzles go, while there's not a lot of creativity from like agency, player agency, well, there's not a lot of it, there's enough of it to, uh, to be satisfying. So I was hoping this was one of those cases. But alas. It's almost identical to the shrines I used to visit in my youth. But it's been twisted, corrupted. Here, Mother Nature is the bringer of bug snacks. The stories they passed down, the warnings about the toxin, they must have come from experience. Yes, the place where I learned about the beauty and wisdom of this world. I hear it's a parking lot now. 
<gasps> no. The mother is of purest light. Her ageless wisdom vastly predates these vile monstrosities. But her followers are a different story. No one starts life off the path. That's why we all need guidance. I grew up hearing stories about the dangers of Snacktooth Island, passed down through the oral tradition from those who survived it. Not that many did survive it. Just enough to give one very clear message. The toxin must not be consumed. And yet? Because it will lead to your doom. What doom, I, I do not know. The story's gotten frustratingly vague over time. I did! Every day at the top of my lungs! It's all of you who didn't listen. It wasn't really a raffle, I can tell you that. <sighs> Come with me to the crater. There's something else I want to see. <laughs> the worst part about this, for me, is that I can't, like I opened this up and I came in here and I just didn't see it. I don't think I went in there more than twice, but I did go in there. May have just been the one time. Yes, this is the place. In the stories, they call this island Broken Two. So the story goes, the toxin's influence grew so great and powerful that the sun itself went dark. And so Mother Nature unleashed her wrath on her errant followers, purging the toxin and sending everything to the depths of the ocean. Looks a lot like wrath to me. But that story never sat right with me. Destroying followers who stray? That isn't the mother I know. She's not the bringer of bug snacks either. The ancients can't even get their story straight. So what am I supposed to believe? If I can't rely on the wisdom of those past, then all that's left is my own experience. I need to meditate. Child, if you would do me a kindness. You see that egg, Lachelle? I need you to crack open three of them. This time it's not a metaphor. God damn it. I'll always love you, Chedor. Where's that last egg? Ow. Don't fuck with me. We're not friends. Being adorable won't, you know, it, that kind of helps. know why you start on fire. Oh, thank you. I know that wasn't an easy task. Ah, 
Uh, bug snacks are so often in the shape of unliving things, but somehow these shells are just shells. <laughs> They're also the only good source of calcium on this island. <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> I'm fighting osteoporosis. Ah, <sighs> anyway, I've centered my thoughts. I want to know for myself what bug snacks are whether they're of the mother or not. I'm going to need that big old nasty flying bug snack. Please, bring it to the box of purity when you get the chance. But it's on fucking fire. It's gonna burn the body. No, whatever. Who eats a warm devil dick? Exactly, that sounds abysmal. I'm sorry, you brought your box of purity? Is I guess. Thank you. I swear I'm not going to eat it this time. Nay, for I seek the very essence of bug snacks. That spirit which drives them to create their poisonous delights. Unfortunately, I have no grumpin' clue how to do that. <gasps> Floofty? Are you out of your grumping mind? One would never consult with that wicked alchemist. Non-binary alchemist. Grow a tree, but I can't do that right now. But, one must admit, when it comes to delving into the Forbidden, there is none more bold than Floofty. Oh, well, if that is how it must be, then may the Mother protect me. Ah, Shelda, you seem to be dangerously close to my personal space. If you're here to trap me in a spell circle again, I will inform you that I could leave at any time and I was merely acting. Temper your contemptuous heart. One is here on a quest for understanding, to unlock the forbidden knowledge of bug snacks. Oh, and you've come to me. Why don't you ask your mother naturally? Or Crystal, or whatever you talk to. The path is shrouded at the moment. One believes that clearing this impasse requires a more scientific lens. How interesting. Are you certain? I'm given to understand that I exude a fetid aura of utter evil from every pore. You are reckless and arrogant and so, so rude. But one does not truly believe that you are evil. <laughs> well, I have little time nor patience for your games. If you want to know something, stop speaking like a horoscope and ask. Ugh. I want to know the essence of bug snacks. What is it they're made of? If I can understand that, then I might know whether they're actually separate from Mother Nature or born from the darkness of her history. I'm not about to resolve your philosophical quandaries. There is no answer to the why of the universe. Bug snacks simply exist. However, since you've finally taken an interest in my studies, then just this once I will educate you. I can show you how to extract live snack matter for microscopic viewing without that matter denaturing. Ah, but if I were to explain it to a very small infant, denaturing is... I know what denaturing means. You do? I'm here to learn about bug snacks, not vocabulary. Aha, uh -huh. very well then. Our lesson should proceed smoothly. Step one of 17, preparing an adequate formalin solution. Thank you for encouraging this old lady to learn something new. Now you better leave us to it. I sense this may take a while. Just heavy breathing from Chantlo in the background. Heavy is the head that wears the pie. nice. Well, if that's the case, then I'm gonna go gather everybody up so we can share what we all learned. This might be a long meeting, so let me know if you've still got some business to do.
maybe that's one of those. This is me asking, can I get that right now or do I have to progress? Because it occurs to me that it could be like a boss snack. Then I'm gonna go gather everybody up so we can share what we all learned. This might be a long meeting, so let me know if you've still got some business to do. Fantastic. All right, everybody, team meeting. Thanks for meeting, everybody. It seems like we've all had an interesting time so far, yeah? Indeed. I must say I'm eager to see what grisly curiosities you found in your studies, Professor. Ah, uh, I better not go first. I'm sure I'll just ramble on all night. <laughs> Say, Chandlo, did you ever find a way to get bigger? Not physically, nah. But I did grow in, like, a metaphorical way. Sorry I couldn't help more with the science. Do not apologize, child. Knowing oneself is the most valuable kind of knowing. Hmm. Huh. And, Shilda... What did you find out about Mother Nature, eh? With some <clears throat> additional insight, one has learned that bug snacks are indeed children of the mother, yet toxins still. Just as every fang dripping with venom, every flower glistening with poisonous sap, a reminder that nature can be very unkind. Grump, yeah? Nature's hardcore! Ah, uh, like some. The ancients may have worshipped the mother, but her light was lost on them. The tooth remains broken, and one believes that this was not the work of the divine. The truth of its destruction and rebirth remains shrouded. That is so interesting! Oh, I swear, we've got to talk about history soon, Shelda. But first, let us discuss my findings. With some <clears throat> minor assistance, I was able to reproduce the newly discovered shrink spice. After some experimenting, I've learned that these big bug snacks are actually small by default. Something about the snack matter on this island causes them to enlarge. I believe I understand the how, but I've yet to discover the why. There is no why, Flutie. Things simply are. Using my words against me. Invent your own wisdom, you sagacious charlatan. I would, if you ever listened to anybody but yourself. Oh, please, let's not start. <laughs> <laughs> What's that happening now? Ha, oh, you missed it, Drift Dog! Flufty and Shelda teamed up to brain slam this mystery! They... they have? Shocking, I know. The things I do for science. Yes, the path is ever winding. But one apologizes for the distraction, as it is time to feast on the fruits of the historian's knowledge. Oh, well, hmm. I... I've certainly learned a lot, but... There are still plenty of mysteries abound, and I think it's possible we'll find all the answers inside the temple. 
Unfortunately, there's a bit of a collapsed hallway there, and I've got no way to get through. I believe we may have a solution for that. My combined research with Shelda has produced something quite useful indeed. A gun. Oh, yeah! Floofty asked me to build Don't a- Don't ruin the surprise. Trust me, it will be very entertaining. Ooh, a more ominous sentence has never been uttered. Well, that all sounds good to me. Let's head to the temple. Well, there it is. Think we can do something about this debris? No problem, Drift Dog. Floofty, let's get the thing ready. Of course, the thing. You, place your buggy ball on the ground in front of us. I have a name, it's Journalist. Good. Now turn around, and no peeking. We wouldn't want to ruin the surprise, would we? All right. I've got it out of the ball. Slippery little Wait, what? thing. Keep it still or the Are you about to Ow! What the grump is that stuff? You'll live. There we go. Oh no. You may now turn around. All right, bro. Feast your eyes on the new and improved. Oh my God! I wanted to call it the engorged strabiform or bacula and please don't. We can't always get what we want. With this much snack power, we can tear down that wall. Ooh, we finally got a way in. Nice there it goes. Everybody. Problem solved. You are all very welcome. Oh, yeah! Big Strabby! Center yourself, Chandlo. This is not a creation to be celebrated, but to be feared. Yeah, but we did do pretty good, huh? Ooh, I could ask a million questions about how that works. But first things first, let's poke around in these ruins. <laughs> Can I, can I have Big Strabby back? Are you, are you okay? You know, it really is a shame that even though its body is so large, its brain is still the same size. Is this a Bacoblin? being sow no not sacrifice to a great maw can you imagine if this game took place in the breath of the wild universe great big hole in the center of the room completely sealed Smeral depicts the ancient grumps is readying a ceremony Please don't. That's so concerning. Nifty. Millie Mo. 
straw. Cool. Holy shit. What am I doing? That's an understatement. <laughs> I told you that the Stone Grumps did ritual sacrifice, yeah? Well, this was the place. They'd throw Grumpuses down that pit, offering them up to <sighs> whatever's down there. Hmm. Is that why the bug snacks here get so big? Because the soil's been uniquely fertilized? <laughs> I found this machine thing buried here. Kinda reminds me of Snorpy's lunch pads. Indeed, yet large enough to launch something of significant size. In fact, it seems to be perfectly suited for the big buggy ball. I believe an experiment is in order. <laughs> Now what? Hmm. There seems to be a triggering mechanism on the back. It may require a jolt from the snack grappler to activate. Oh my god. Uh -oh. What did you all do? The disturbance is emanating from the sealed pit! Ready yourselves! A grave danger approaches! Bros, I get the feeling I'm about to get dunked on again! Oh, God. My friends. Fine. 
so I'm sorry, but... Ow, I was reading. Grab one. Don't be mad. Get it. They're angry. Oh, 
that many. Oh, good. Oh, he's back. One second. Yeah, that, that phase I did, uh, pretty much one. Are you, what? Give me that. There's a go juice. thing. in one piece that was the biggest snack i've ever seen nothing like a giant monster fight to get the blood pumping <laughs> speak for yourself 
One is far too old for this. Agreed. But now that the danger is past, I'd like to revisit what precisely all of this means. You know, judging by the temple roof, the collapses, the crater, I mean, it's just a thought. But I think ages ago something big came out of that pit. Well, yeah. We just saw the Cheddar Bortle come out of there. <laughs> if the Cheddar Bortle could be handled by one mediocre journalist, I doubt it could what? destroy an entire okay. civilization. Yeah, I'm thinking much bigger and much nastier. Something we can hardly even imagine. The wrath of Mother Nature, or perhaps the wrath of those sacrificed. Amusing as this grisly history is, None of that explains why the island suddenly rose from the sea. Maybe it wanted to be found. Ah, uh, islands don't generally want things, Chandlo. Unless those lost and vengeful lie dormant still beneath our feet. You know, I think I've learned all I can for now. What say we call it quits today? For our own good. All yes, right, yes. sounds good to me. Okay, so do you want to come back to the raft with us or keep exploring? Oh, all righty. Just be sure to meet us by the raft when you're ready. I would not eat a bug snack. I think that would be a mistake. Speaking of mistakes. If I had to, which body part would I swap? Uh, depends on the snack. I don't think I would want, I would probably do the, uh, someone with the penis change it to a millim, I would, hmm, there's a chilly willy joke in there somewhere. snack already exists. There are multiple. Oh, that's fine. I'm a monster. I mean, uh, of course you are. I had the utmost faith in you. Oh, please. You were likely in tears the entire time. I was not! Uh, Trithany, what in the world did you find out there? Oh, gosh. That's a long story. I kind of want to get home to Wamby first, if you don't mind. But uh, let's meet up in town, and I'll tell you the details over some snack waters, yeah? Yes, let's! Ah, and... Shelter's alive and well. Yeah, my joints are killing me. <laughs> but sure. I, uh, uh, one must meditate with a tincture of willow and cloves. Uh, if you inform me of the recipe, I could find a way to augment the effects. 
consider this an effort to be less deliberately antagonistic towards you. Uh, thanks, I guess. Floofties being helpful? Seriously, Chandler, what happened over there? Grumpinati mind control? I don't know. We're just finding ourselves out here, Snorp Dog. And, uh, speaking of that, Snorpy, I'm sorry for making you come to Snack Tooth. Oh, well, well, that's all right. It may not be my favorite place, but, but I know you're just doing what you think is best. Yeah, that's the problem. Well, you sound like you've got something weighing on your mind. Yeah, I do. But I think it can wait. Let's just go home and chill, okay? Ah, ah well, well, I'm nothing if not chill. Thanks for everything, dog. We'll see you back at Snacksburg! Something very heavily weigh or heavy weighing on my mind. We'll talk about it later. Bilbo wants to talk to me. How's it going? Why did I do this to you? Hold on. I love it. It's the butter. Wow, it's getting crowded around here. I can't believe it. We gotta celebrate big time. This party's gonna change everything, buddy. Are you sure you're ready? I'm pretty sure I've done everything. Wait, he's got places to be, it's fine. I got the thing for all the side quests complete and all the interviews. I'm doing, I'm missing something. Uh oh. What's going on, Outside of the hats. Oh yeah, I did find the key. Forgot about the key. I got the one that's here. Can I shuffle those pages? Maybe that's it. Sound they make. It's it. I said it once. I'll say it again. It's like a cat vomiting. Still secrets buried there. 
maybe on snack tooth too so always keep your eyes open <laughs> golden strappy excellent buddy wow now you're good ruby got every kind of bug snack there's got to be a prize for that or something hold on Let's see what i can throw together Oh shit, I didn't notice that. Oh, that's why. That's what it was. Okay. It's like, where was it? The nuts. Uh, what else did I get? I'm keeping that. I don't think I ever... Oh, Jesus Christ. I completely forgot about the key. Where? this nonsense about them because I it told me that I did all the side quests. Uh get that one out of well.
I would love to get that, but the game doesn't want to let me use my shit. Are you telling me I have to parkour? Cause I'll, oh jeez. Hello. Hi. Hello. Yeah, yes, hello. Hey, hey. I legit thought she was pulling out a gun. How the fuck? Maybe I... Hmm. Are you unable to... Are you unable to get this now? Because there's that one time when you can use your shit here. I completely forgot about it. Wait. Maybe? That's what this is for. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm not using that. Okay. Sorry if I was cold to you before. I know you've been interviewing everybody, so if you got more oh hey. clues Matt because I have paper I'm potty training Befica it's fine okay oh uh, right right uh, you are a journalist after all honestly I'm nothing special but if you really want to know more about me I'll answer your questions <clears throat> Dr. Agabel Batternugget, MD. Well, in school, I focused on endocrinology, but the clinic I worked at was so small. In practice, I wound up doing family medicine. Come on, you know why. <sighs> Lizbert said I didn't have to come, that she'd be back to see me whenever she could, but I wasn't going to let myself get left behind. What do you think about the snacks? They're a perfectly balanced source of nutrition with upsetting side effects that are otherwise harmless. They make me feel like, for a little while, Nothing else in the world matters. And that can be nice sometimes. Wait, you're allergic to bug snacks? What have you been eating all this time? I can't in good conscience. Uh, okay, good. It's not the healthiest diet long term, but... Ramble and Shelda are doing all right. Mm, I'll give you a checkup once we've brought Liz back home. Why not before? What if that, you know what, fine. We've covered that already. <laughs> I know everything about Liz, but somehow she's still a mystery to me. It's been like that since day one. I was working at my clinic in the middle of nowhere, thinking about how, once again, I didn't have any plans for the weekend. When Elizabeth Megafig literally kicked down my door and immediately passed out. 
her injuries were pretty serious. Bone fractures, full body contusions, and way less blood than she ought to have. Mm. When she was conscious again, she told me all about her adventures. The ruin collapse that nearly killed her. The treasure of Grumsylvania. Everything. The second she could walk, Liz tried going right back to those ruins. I just carry around packets upon packets of uh, Taco Bell fire sauce. Every time I'm a little peck, I should just squirt one in my mouth. I couldn't stop her, so I decided to go with her just to make sure she'd be okay. And one amazing adventure later, I quit my job and left town with the love of my life. Oh, we're done? Well, thanks for keeping me company. Hey, uh, you know how to use the projector, right? Here, take this. It's nice to look back on the good times once in a while, and I think you'd like to see it. Well, I'll, I'll get back to it. Stay safe out there. And I don't want to do those other ones. There's one in particular that I'm not looking forward to. Where was that? I'm trying to remember if there's a door somewhere that I saw. Someone had to make these sounds. Now let's see. Am I? So there's still one there. So who's at my ship? Hey, mind your own beeswax, huh? just I can't be here
that a sandwich it is. Hey, how's it going? Uh, thanks for the help. Thanks for taking the time to talk to me. I hate to admit it, but I'm pretty lonely up here and it feels nice to just talk. Take care of yourself, all right? Did I not do that? No, I've done that. All right. Hey, a nice bed. Seeing all the snacks you caught in Flavor Falls, I'm thinking I shouldn't farm there after all. Those green olives are a grump and menace. Hey, buddy. And it's goddamn it. God damn it. They just keep going, huh? Uh, Instabug was... I'm pretty sure I can count them. Oh, well, beef in the river, good thing. Yeah. Mm. Done that. Neat. Pretty good, there were indeed more snacks in Boiling Bay than I had witnessed. Mm. Purge? Oh no. six I've done. I figure out what to do with that 
Jeez, soon enough. What? So much shit. Oh, no. I don't like this. It is, or is it? X five snack pods in under thirty seconds. That's so many calories for that. doors or things that I found that aren't in the, the frozen waste. I believe that's directly tied to
Where are you? Not you, Togepi. There you are. your landing that's not caged chicken nugget box snack. Nice to see you. Agro. Come on. <laughs> hey, buddy. I've got another surprise for you. Let's go see your hut. Uh oh. I lifted your crib, dog! Woo! That's right. You've got a two-floor apartment now. You're really moving up in the world, huh? I was just thinking you've gotten so many presents from the rest of us, you are probably running out of room. That is so thoughtful. <laughs> I even asked Chandlo for a third floor, but he said something about restricted airspace. Uh, 
That's Spilbro. As mayor of Snacksburg, you really ought to read up on our zoning guidelines. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll uh, I'll, I'll do that. In the meantime, buddy, I can't wait to see what you do with your new place. Grump, yeah, dog. Especially after we send you even more stuff. Thanks, I guess. Metal plating, huh? Pattern in my dreams. Could it be it was an old memory? Pattern on a tablecloth. A pattern on a tablecloth. Oh no. Oh, that's what it was. Okay. Oh yeah, that makes sense. I guess I already did that. Huh? It's cold, but isn't frosty. Okay, I know which one that is. torn because this about this I am expecting a formulaic rehash of fallen order and I hope that's incorrect I'm oh, sorry is that supposed to be skin I love it getting a just getting one snacky boy I only remember where one is Buddy. 
How you doing? I don't think that's the right one. Pretty snack that loves the cold, but isn't frosty. isn't evasive. That's what I... No, it's not fruity. You're, you're merely postponing the inevitable. Oh, you cheeky.
Oh, that's nice. Okay. Yeah, that just happened. Thanks, Agabelle. I... I guess I'll, uh... Guess I'll die. going on in there? Are they fighting? We missed so far, um, we did the DLC island. Sleeping in your bed, okay. thanks. No. 
nerd. Thanks for the help. Crusade kit for fabrics. means Scattering across the sand. D&D character has four parents. Need more information. I never actually looked at this thing. I hate this so much. This is awful. Be what you want. I had one. Yeah. What? It wasn't that. So I'm confused. Across sand. This is where there's sand.
this last one. And I'll watch the thing and feed the cats. And I make call it. Give me the... around with the entrance closest to where you came in or uh ported in hey buddy oh god i don't sign opportunity i don't Is this out on Switch yet? I don't recall. I know it's supposed to be coming to Switch if it's not already. It is. Do 
He just said flavor town. Fuck. Was it? Uh... Wait, no. It was here. Right? God. Bill Boat could have been the mayor of Flavortown. I'll be fine. it's still together. Thank 
for understanding. You're, in, you're having a bad time. You know what? Is there a bed out here? Noodler, no. Leave him be.
No doubt. Who wanted this nonsense? Uh, wait, no, it's right. Oh, God. Who? Who does this go? This is me asking. If I get it wrong, I have to capture it again, and I don't want to. See, I haven't seen him at all. Where? Is he by my boat? No, he's right hey, here. Pal. Actually, it makes sense. You know, that's perfect. for hanging out. Let me see who's doing what. Characters in the game. My life is shit. Go get him. I figured it out. My life is shit. Not ship. You know what? It's fine. I'll cut a bloody path. All right. Thank you all for hanging out. Have a good night. See you all next time.